baby Jonathan is sick. Check this video out. Oh God. <laughs> Best friends. At the doctor's urgent care with the baby. He's sick, had a fever for about four nights, three days. And this is what he does to the doctor's office. Rearrange the furniture. Mind you, the chair's supposed to be all the way over there with the other chair. Instead, he got it all the way back here. Guess what? He can have at it. We're gonna be in here for a while. They have to get a yarn out of him. Gave him some apple juice to drink. He drank it all. Say hi. Hi, best friends. He just wanted to say hi to y'all. And he ain't pee yet. So. They don't know what's you know going on yet. I think I might just be viral. Um, have fever. It breaks with medication. Comes back. He been in daycare. Still, they've been working with me. Still taking him so I could go to work. Still. Um, no air infection this time, which I kind of figure. I was kind of hoping to at least we know what it is, but no air infection. Check his mouth, no strep throat or nothing like that. I know he don't look sick, which I'm happy about, and that's a blessing. And he don't look like he feels sick, but definitely got a fever, so they want to see if it's like a bladder infection or a urine infection or something like that. Um, UTI, I mean, infection. I'm tired, worked all day to come early to get this little boy in daycare. I just wanted to keep y'all guys updated that Bestie Inventor has her great days and not so great days. This is one of the not so great days to have a headache. Just want to make sure my baby's fine. Like any parent, you get concerned when your child isn't 100%. So, y'all keep y'all fingers crossed, prayers high. For baby Jonathan, I love this. How they got this whole theme in the background. Look, see it? Can y'all see? Like an under the sea theme on the wall? This kid. Don't worry, he's going to definitely bathe. Now he's lifting the chair up. He's going to tilt it over. Destroying a doctor's office. That's all I gotta say. This is what I'm gonna name this video. Sick baby destroys the doctor's office. Monster baby. Now he's going for the other one that was minding his own business. Yep, you. Sick baby destroys the doctor's office. <laughs> And that's why he's dressed like that, by the way. We had to take his pants off so that he could collect the urine samples. It's inside like a little bag inside his diaper. Uh-uh. Now that one we won't be doing. We'll not be messing with sockets, buddy. Keep sticking to the chairs. Alright, guys. I'm about to check out. Um, I'll probably do a part two to this video to give an update. If not, if I don't do an update, forgive me. It's a lot going on. But my goal, playing with the wall. My goal is to do an update um, video right after to see what, to t to tell you guys what happens. Uh-oh. Yeah, get up. Ah. Ah. Such a faker. Ah. Ah. That's this fake ouch. Ah. Yeah, goes on the floor and says, ah. What can I say? Let a kid. All right, guys, we out. Baby, sick baby, destroys the doctor's office. <laughs> Bye, best friends. Bye, y'all. Are you guys ready for part two? of sick baby destroys the doctor's office 
What can I tell you? He's my baby boy. Thank you. He needs to use the bathroom any moment now or the doctor is not gonna have any more rolling paper yet. Thank you. He found out where it is and he won't stop. Sick baby continues to tear up the doctor's office. Part two. See how long he preoccupies himself with looking off this paper. My Can I help him? Uh, yeah, no. We've been here for over an hour. And he's been cranky. He's hungry. He is confined to this small room with no toys. So, guess what? Sorry, my insurance should cover this. Best friends. Yes. What do y'all think about Monster Baby? Leave a comment at the bottom of this video. Like, share, and subscribe. Yeah, yeah. yeah say like, share, and subscribe. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Get tired? Must be strength ain't as great. Oh, maybe not. Oh, that's a big piece. <laughs> Thank you, baby monster. Doctor is going to charge you up. Well, mommy. Whatever makes you happy, baby monster. Thank you. <laughs> now what? Get up the nasty floor. Uh uh, get up. What's that? Tissue? No, no, no. Put that in an electrical socket. Yeah, give it to me. What is it? Thank you. Hmm? Thank you. Don't know what it is, but thank you. I don't feel like nothing. Thank you. Second cup of juice. But his belly is full, 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 full. We'll continue to see if he's going. Thank you. Continue this. Oh, he found one on the floor. Here. You're going to put it back on the floor. As long as you don't put it in that mouth, we could. Now you got two of them. Oh, wow. I know. Eat, eat. Yes, it's that mouth. Jinx it. No, he, no, he cannot taste the paper. Thank you. This is going to be the end of the paper saga for you. Stop it. Thank you. He's pretending to eat it. Watch this. He's not even eating it. Look. See? Ah, no. Now no, no, that one he actually ate. <laughs> you still got more in there? Eat that nasty. Yeah, no, I know. No, eat, eat, you little faker. That was nothing in your hand. No, no eat, eat. Thank you. Oh, here we go with the sockets. They need to baby proof these rooms. No, no, no. Alright. Best friends. Checking out of the uh oh now he goes on the trash. No, no eat. Checking out of baby monster. Sick baby. Clean the floor with it and everything. Sick baby. Tears up the doctor's office. Let me take that before he try to eat it. Say bye-bye, best friends. Bye-bye. He don't care. All right, peace out. Bye, y'all. Hold your breath. Baby monster just got started. Check this out. Update, guys. Um, sick baby still finishes off with messing up doctor's office. See, half that paper, almost half that paper is gone. The paper is almost completely out. Um, trash filled with paper for me going away. Also, short. can't find out a lot of uh, so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Jonathan, for the win. <laughs> yes, results are in. Let's go see what they are. No, not that way, this way. Look this way.
Have a good night. Say thank you. After you tour up your room. <laughs> Have a good night. All right, so sanitizing. All right, because you done touch everything. Figure it out. Like, I'll put the one in the flag. Yeah, the flag. Yeah, I'm just sitting there. Natasha and I like, you know, Sometimes, like, I'll put it in, even though I'll send it to the artist. Ready? No, it's trash. It's dirty. Come on. Say bye bye to the ladies. Say bye bye to the ladies. Oh, that's that cone, that dirty cone. Uh -huh. Nasty weather out here. Late in these streets. Woo, misty, rain, coldy. Coldy. Good oh boy. You took that stuff like a champ, buddy. Say the champ is here. The champ is here. The champ is here. Big boy in the car. Put the stuff up in his bag, his papers, his discharge papers. We have to follow up tomorrow with his pediatrician's office. But they couldn't find anything wrong with him. Everything is everything. All right. Where is my keys? There we go. Time to go. So, like I was saying, they couldn't find anything wrong with him. Um, after the urine sample, they um, they said the urine looks good. Everything looks great. So, they just said follow up with his pediatrician's office tomorrow. Just to make sure they haven't missed anything and go from there. But they just think it's a regular virus. He actually broke out and bumps all over his body more recently. And when I say more recently, I mean like when we got there, it was like bumps all over his body. Small little bumps. Um, and I showed Dr. Dad and a nurse and it was like, yeah, that's a result of like a fever, like the, the aftermath of a fever. So it was like nothing concerning. And I remember when my oldest son had the bumps all over his body, little red bumps. They call it like roseola virus or something. So this is kind of looking familiar. No antibiotics, nothing. It's kind of like just works its way out. And what the doctor was saying that it may work its way out in forms of he may start getting a cold or he may, you know, start having the runs. You know, his stools may be very watery and consistency. So the virus could work its way out. Um, it's going to find its way out somehow. So it's like the body's brewing up the infection and then it's going to find its way out. So, hey y'all, it's back there if you can see him. But um, now it's 6.47. I was actually debating if I wanted to go to Walmart and get him some clothes right now or go straight home. But like, I'm really tired, I'm really sleepy. Um, which is part of the reason why I'm thinking about going to Walmart. I know it sounds crazy, but I figure if I go to Walmart, that helps me stay up. For moms, you know what I'm saying. You keep yourself occupied. I have run off of no coffee all day today. This is my first day with no coffee, believe it or not. So actually, I think it would be a good idea for me to stop at like Dunkin' Donuts, pick me up a coffee, go home and feel comfortable, change my clothes, bathe him, um... So I'm like, get ready for bed. Because I'm like, 
he may be too tired to go to Walmart anyway. He may start fussing and everything because I picked him up over two hours ago, like two and a half hours ago from daycare. And he hasn't had like no food to eat or anything. All he had was um, apple juice, as y'all seen um, previously. So he may actually start cutting up on Walmart because he might be hungry. So what I think I'm going to do is go pick up Jalen and Gianna. Um... I know his grandma made him food yesterday, so I'll probably feed him that. And then um, take him home, feed him, bathe him. And then he'll probably go to bed kind of early because, you know, he don't feel the greatest. So that's the story of it all. Um, fever is broken for now, as it's been doing these past few days. Um, God willing. It'll be going, going soon, like today, tonight. It won't come back, and we'll be fine. But this is what happens when the weather starts changing, too. This is like, this is the stuff that you have to deal with over here in the East Coast. <sighs> Tell you, I have a headache. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get myself a cup of joe. Oh, that's a cute pumpkin. This is like, and I also wanted to pick up, like, decorations for the house, too. What I may do is have the children start pulling out the Halloween stuff. And um, we can decorate like this weekend, even though it's gonna be cold. So that's that. Thank you guys for tuning in. Don't forget like, comment, subscribe, and share. Um, and press that notification bell if you haven't done so already. Yes, I am learning from GJ's World, my daughter's YouTube video, what to say and how to say it. Because best believe, um, I thought I was far from a YouTuber, but. You know, many people have been telling me that they are very interested in what I have to say. So, YouTube, here we are, Bestie and Vincer. All right. All right, good night, my best friends. Bye, y'all.